Hey folks, today I have Ritual Coffee. This is called San Jose, and the name comes from where it's grown. So it's grown in San Jose de Pedregal, Colombia. And they have the flavor notes written at the bottom here. I always like the packaging for Ritual Coffee, but more so than the packaging, the way it tastes is great. So they have four locations here in California. Three of them are here in San Francisco, and they actually have one in Napa that I got to visit. But I'm never disappointed with the stuff I tried from them. They tend to be lighter roasts, but very fruity coffees that really get your taste buds jumping for joy. So this, once again, is San Jose. And flavor notes, which are gonna kind of ruin my perception here and give me a little bit of a, a pre-bias, but it's a blackberry, black currant, muscat raisin, dark honey. You say currant or currant? I don't know, but I like the fruit regardless. So I'll see if I taste any of that or anything else. And as usual, I'll be looking at flavor, aftertaste. Um, what was it again? We're going to look for acidity and we're going to look for uh, the body, so how thick, and then we're going to check out, oh god, my brain is fried right now, but I won't bore you with it. I'll explain later on. So one more thing, I'm going to be brewing with a Brazen Plus today. Okay, coffee has been brewed. <clears throat> so that fifth thing that I forgot to mention was aroma. So that's what we're gonna start out with when I'm reviewing this. First off, let me show you what the beans look like because I forgot to do that. Again, it is pretty light roast from my recollection, but you could argue that this is on the medium range too. Um, the aroma of the beans themselves are stronger than the the first coffee I reviewed, and once again, this is only my second coffee review, so go easy on me. But Andy Town's coffee, the Ethiopia Yerga Chef, really didn't have too much aroma. Uh, from the beans themselves, but this one has a very nice <laughs> fragrance. Um, post brew, it's also pretty, pretty strong, pretty delicious. The taste is pretty consistent with the aroma, so I'd say. scale of one to five, about a four. Um, the flavor itself, I'm picking up a little bitterness, not too much. Definitely a lot more acidity than bitterness. It's, it's very bright, like, well, it's bright like most ritual coffees tend to be. Um, but not a lot of sweetness, I'd say. Uh, it's a good balance, but very, very astringent uh, in the aftertaste. Like, I'm getting a lot of dryness um, and really not picking up too much taste post-sip. So the initial flavor is, is pretty good. Very fruity. And again, not too bitter, but a little on the bitter side. More on the bitter side than the sweet side. So, as far as flavor goes, I'd give it about a three. Aftertaste, I'd say also a three. I, I mean, I'm picking up a little bit, but the astringency is kind of killing it for me. Uh, so we've talked about aroma, flavor, aftertaste. 
Uh, I also talked a little bit about acidity, so there is plenty of it, and I think it's it's on the good side. So definitely a fruity coffee. I'd be willing to give this a four and a half here uh, in terms of the acidity level. Nothing sour about it, which is what you don't want. So uh, definitely a winner in that department. Finally, we have body. So best way to pick up body from what I learned is to just take a sip. Let it sit, sit in your mouth for a little bit. And um, the body of this coffee, I would say, is right in the middle also. I know that's kind of a cop-out answer, but it, it's not very heavy, um, not very light. Um, somewhere in the middle, but if I had to, to give it a score, I wouldn't say three. I'd say probably a three and a half because I am feeling a little bit of siltiness in my mouth. So once again, that is San Jose. Um, I believe it's a single origin. It doesn't actually say here, but it's grown in Colombia and it's by Ritual Coffee Roasters here in San Francisco. So thanks for bearing with me on my second coffee review and hope the ones from here on out are a little bit better. Thanks.